Hello friends, my name is Ghost Raven, and let me welcome you back to my gameplay to my let's play of the Assassin's Creed 1. I hope you're having a good day, but if you don't, don't worry, the things will get eventually better and you will get through anything, trust me, okay? Right now, just sit back, relax, enjoy, and let's get into this, let's resume session. Yeah, right. Hello there, so we back in the MSTF once again. Hello friends. Hello ladies, you didn't move since the last time. Alright. And who do we have to kill today? Well, that's the question. We will have to deal with. Do we have anything to train? Let me just see real quick. It seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield the blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. Yeah, maybe, I just wanna see. Oh, the dodging, we already know that. Okay. Bye bye, I guess. Yeah, I'm busy, I'm traveling to Jerusalem. Alright. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the bureau once again. Nothing, I'm just fast traveling. Preparation is crucial to your success. Nothing extraordinary, I guess. Alright, we are. In Jerusalem, I guess, yeah, we are. So, same as always, I created timestamps, which you're going to see on the video. If you want to skip these activities, you don't have to watch them, I mean... I'm just going to be blabbering about some things that will come to my mind eventually and things like that, so... Yeah. Yeah, I decided to, you know, create these longer chapters. Oh, come on, don't fall, I'll tell you. These longer episodes, I believe the last two went over one hour mark, if I'm not mistaken. It's not something I would like to be doing on the um, everyday basis, but it's hard to cut this game, you know, because the structure of it and the activities and things like that make it so much harder to put down in the middle of something. You know, it feels almost like in one sitting you have to beat one target or assassinate one target and do all of those side missions and main investigation in one go, you know. So I thought this is the best way to get about, basically. And that's what I'm going to do, so Let's save another citizen, the first one in this in this episode. Come on guys, hit me. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. I should probably talk about something. I was thinking about you know topics, subjects which I could tackle. And well something came to my mind. Yeah, I will be continuing after this. Oh, thank you, kind sir. So yeah, last time I was talking about um, Assassin's Creed games, the free-to-play model, micro micro transactions. Guess that is a hard word to say. And loot boxes and things like that. And I thought about you know there are quite many, or they were quite many free-to-play Assassin's Creed games. Um, well, basically, three of them comes to my mind as of now. Where are you exactly? Anyway, I will find you. And I will be talking about them in an order of release, basically. That's the best way to get around, I guess. So the first free-to-play game which I can remember, with the Assassin's Creed name on it, brand, the logo, the franchise, I believe it was in... 2010, 11, I guess, the cold game Assassin's Creed Project Legacy, maybe some of you older folks, I don't mean that as an insult, you probably remember this game, it was a Facebook game if I remember correctly, yeah I was using my my account to, to play it on, on 
Facebook exclusively. Unfortun unfortunately, yeah, it was one of the few games, or probably the only game, I ever played on Facebook. And I mean, it was it was quite fun. I don't remember any microtransactions. I don't remember so much about the game anyway, but I... Well, how it worked exactly. But I remember that... Yeah, it was pretty fun for what it was. It was connected in a large way to the newly released Assassin's Creed Bar newly released Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, I remember correctly. If I remember correctly. Oh, well, there's a flag. I'm going to pick it up. And yeah, you would send your assassins on the missions and don't get my word for it, but I don't know. Oh, come on, man. D don't you. Don't you do that. That was rude. I'm going to throw you out. Yeah, off the roof. If I remember correctly, you can use your assassins from the game. And don't get my word for it. I'm not quite sure. Maybe my mind is playing tricks on me. But I remember using my assassins from the game, which I have saved in a brotherhood. In that very game, it was some somehow connected, if I remember correctly, and you can send your assassins on different missions. You know, it was the basic timer stuff you would see even in the main games. But yeah, and there were some extra original missions. I don't know if it's canon or not in the main. Oh, come on, don't you, don't you hurt yourself. I don't remember the plot really, it was, you know, just an expansion of the of the universe and things like that, but yeah, I got pretty fond memories of it. Unfortunately, the game was discontinued, I don't know when exactly, but yeah, it was already a couple of years since it was really playable. I was trying to find out some information of why it wasn't available or why it isn't available right now and apparently the game didn't follow the terms and conditions of the you know Facebook games and applications and things which is really a shame it was it was quite interesting and fun I remember playing this game when I was you know just on my Facebook chatting with my friends and things like that but yeah it was it was pretty fun, as far as I can remember. And there, there was another game which I only played really recently because I didn't have to go to phone to to really play it. And that was Assassin's Creed Pirates. Yeah, before I go any further, unfortunately, as far as I can remember, this this game was also discontinued. Quite a few years ago, I believe, the last update it received was in 2016 and even it even was removed from the Google Play Store, if I remember correctly, and from the, the similar alternative for the iPhone, I don't, I don't really know, I never had iPhone or iPad or anything with I at the beginning But yeah, it was unfortunately discontinued, but the game itself well it Was riding on a wave on the Assassin's Creed Black Flag which came out in 2013 I believe and this game came around similar time and Yes, I, and I played it quite recently like Three years ago for the first time, maybe two. Oh, someone is coming out to me, maybe a Templar. Where are you? I know you're here By the looks of things. And I really enjoy that. It's a free-to-play game, once again, as I'm saying. I'm gonna beat these guys while talking about that. It's a free-to-play game. It has microtransactions. It has some, you know, different customization, which you can buy for money. But actually, the system of this microtransaction is 
it's quite nice, you know, you don't have to buy anything, really, there are no timers, nothing that will really hold your progress in a meaningful or distinctive way. I mean, the game itself is basically made up of few types of minigames, I would say, this is probably the best way how to describe it. First you have your ship, well basically you can buy many, many ships, a whole bunch of them actually, and use them in the missions, so you can, you know, traverse the environment, the sea on your ship, and the camera, the position of it, and the controls, you know, feel very samey to the Assassin's Creed 3 when the ship combat force introduced for the first time and of course Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag which goes without saying I don't know if this game is also canon I have to you know dig deeper to to really be sure if that's the case but yeah so you will travel across the sea finding enemies and you know the battles themselves are really nice mini games in and of itself you know you have to fire at enemy ships dodge them with with the pressing oh there you are templar come on there you are with a hidden blade oh someone else dodge them with a you know well time controls which are alt touch based but they are very intuitive and I'm very original, I think. Of course, um, if you saw any gameplay of, if you played it, I mean, the ability how individual ships can slow down or gain speed in order to evade the enemy ships is quite amusing, really. But it's, it's supposed to be like that, you know, it's an arcade game. And you know, you would fight enemy ships, gain gold, experience, you can buy better ships, better customization, weapons and things like that, but also, oh come on, man don't you, I have to kill you, right now, oh don't you worry I'm going to get you, what did you, you know you painted my bottom part, I'll throw you out, are you dead? Oh, no. Jesus Christ. Come on. Well, this is getting out of hand really quickly. Come on. Yeah, so... But... It's no limited only to playing with your ship, you know, and defeating other ships, but also you have something like a treasure hunt missions, when you're actually playing in a first person mode, and you would, you know, search for treasure, it's like a runner game, if you played something like, I don't know how they are called, gosh, I forgot, there's one Tomb Raider game like that, which you, you know, run forward, evading the different obstacles, trying to collect points, collect coins and points and treasure and things like that and it's really interesting and you know so I really really enjoy that aspect of it and there are also many different story missions in the structure it's very really similar to the you know original Assassin's Creed games of the mainstream Assassin's Creed games main games, which means, well, you got story missions which are not voiced, you know, you got a lot of text going around, there's music which is beautiful, so you got these things, and also, you don't only battling other ships, but you also get other objectives, you know, like following other ship, trying to catch them, maybe evade some ships to sneak into some, some ports. 
Well, some make only downside, but actually there is no way how to... Oh, come on. To play the game like this, you know, there's no way how to control your assassin doing... Or a pirate, I mean. I don't know if he's assassin, I never finished the game, unfortunately. Like this, you know, the first person and the over head and the third person controls of your ship is everything that you can get but still pretty funny you know and as I said there are no timers nothing it that can help you progress you know of course you have to grind for things for the expensive ones for those special things but you can also hunt different animals like whales and things like that you know collect them even even fishing if I remember correctly yeah, you can fish for different fishes, and you can find the treasures in this in this way. And they are quite funny. Some of them, some of those treasures, yeah, you can find a boot. You know, just a <laughs> just a boot. You know, and things like that, a shoe, if you will, and things like that. So I really, really enjoy that, and I really recommend it if you can find it. There's actually a way how to how to download it. I saw it. Let me kill this Templar. Rest in peace. So, but I saw there's a, actually a way how to purchase it. No, not purchase it. It's a free-to-play game. I don't know if it was really for sale sometime in the past, but yeah, there are links to download it. I was fortunate enough to download it when it was still active, so I got it in my library. You know, on my on my mobile phone. And on my account, Google account, that is. But yeah, it's still pretty fun. So I totally recommend it. Yeah, and the last game which I should talk about. Probably I wouldn't have too much time to talk about that. Maybe I'll leave it on the next episode. How many more viewpoints? If just one, I'm going to leave it. But yeah. The next game I want to talk about, you know, I want to talk about these, these free to play games because there are really no spoilers for the future titles, which I quite enjoy because I don't want to, you know, spoil some plot elements or features, gameplay options for the games in the future. You know, I want to keep it as a surprise. When we going to get there, I want to want to play every major game and maybe maybe these games too, you know. I can imagine myself playing Assassin's Creed Pirates on this channel, you know, and it would be quite fun. But anyway, the last game I want to talk about, free to play game, you probably know this if you are an Assassin's Creed fan. In the last couple of years, there's a one game called Assassin's Creed Rebellion, if I am not mistaken. And, you know, you basically in this game create your own brotherhood. And you send them on missions. But you're actually controlling your character, sort of, on the missions. You know, you will decide what they will do on the different parts. I believe it was made alright. All viewpoints scaled. I won't be talking about this in up another episode, so stay tuned, I definitely will. Oh my, that that was fast. This went <laughs> too fast. All this talking, all this saving civilians. But yeah, I want to say that I believe it was made by the same people who made Follow Shelter, which was... Well, curiously, it was also released on a PC, on a Steam. Interestingly, Assassin's Creed Rebellion wasn't released, but anyway, on PC just yet. But anyway, this... This game is very similar, Fallout Shelter, to the Assassin's Creed Rebellion in many aspects, and many graphical interfaces, options, and things like that are very similar. And the gameplay is quite quite similar in, in some ways, you know. But we're going to talk about this 
later because I'm still playing this and I got a lot of things to say about that game. So anyway, let's get into this. Let's talk to our informant and finally find out who do we have to kill. Hey there, Malik. Safety and peace, Malik. Where that the city was possessed of either. Why do you trouble me today? Al Muallam has marked Mejdud Dean for death. What can you tell me about him? Salahuddin's absence has left the city without a proper leader, and Majduddin has appointed himself to play the part. Fear and intimidation get him what he wants. He has no true claim to the position. That ends today. You speak too readily. This is not some slaver we're discussing. He rules Jerusalem and is well protected because of it. I suggest you plan your attack carefully. Get to better know your prey. With your help, I will. Where would you have me begin my search? What's this? You're actually asking for my assistance instead of demanding it. I'm impressed. Be out with it. As you wish. Here's where I would look. First, to the southwest near the mosque. After that, head south of here. There are two locations that might interest you. The southernmost church is one, the other is in the streets, near a synagogue. Thank you for your help, Dai. Don't foul this, Altair. Oh, thank you, Malik. Thank you, brother. You see, we can we can cooperate, we can work together. Alright, let's find out something about our target. Who do we have to kill? And for what exactly? For a reason. So, yeah, we can do this one first. I mean, it's the closest one. Inform a escort challenge. We already know what it takes to do. To accomplish, I mean this objective but anyway yeah by the way if you are hearing some voices on the background well that's my neighbors watching TV I close all the windows and doors to make this my studio if you will in many many quotations and quite apparent at soundproof as it's possible I mean but you know I don't know it's like seven hours in the evening and you know almost every day my neighbors are watching news or something like that and so loudly then I can actually hear what is going on in the TV I don't know why they're doing this maybe they don't hear too well but anyway I hope nothing is oh come on I didn't do anything I was just walking by this is too rude so I truly hope you don't hear anything of that you know I'm trying to mask it with my talking with my voice cutting out the audio when the characters are speaking so you can hear what is going on because I'm not trying to do this like yeah well this is my commentary watch it but also I want you to follow the story I want you to experience what is going on you know I don't want to I don't want this to be, you know, just my blabbering, blabbering, I don't know what am I saying anymore. I'm trying to sound intelligent and using words that don't really exist, I think. <laughs> but anyway, let's talk to our informant. Hello there. Of course. Of course. Let's see. Oh, that's a long way. How many meters? Oh, like 80. And you look. It looked much more far away on my GPS. Do you know what the GPS is anyway, friend? You probably don't. Or oh, some someone is attacking. Whoa, that was that was too rude. Leave him alone. He's my friend. Oh, you won't attack me. That's good. But you will. You will. Alright. You will pay for your life. Alright. Let's move. Nothing to see here. Nothing happened. By the way, I will try to limit my... Frequent words when I'm... What I'm saying when I'm editing the videos. I'm actually getting embarrassed when... You know, I'm using words like, alright, alright, so frequently, or something like, oh no, oh god, 
it can be so annoying. So I'm trying to cut it out sometimes when I feel there's too much of it in a quick succession. Succession. Gosh darn it. You see, I'm trying to sound intelligent. <laughs> it sometimes doesn't work. And sometimes when I'm listening to my recordings, when I'm editing it, rendering it, and things like that, I notice how many mistakes I made. I don't use the um, words correctly sometimes. I don't use the right tense on many occasions. But hopefully we can understand each other. I'm still trying to get into this. It's really hard to talk, record, and play at the same time in a language that is not my own by the default it's not my mother tongue what are you doing my friend come on and so many of you gosh from where did you come from all of you he's going to attack how did you know I'm going to do exactly that man this is a long way you know we <laughs> traverse like 40 meters and already kill like 20 soldiers come on man oh you can run when I run that's good come on quickly oh no not again this is getting out of hand <laughs> reminds me of Star Wars oh come on no there's too many of them I don't even see what I'm doing Yeah, killing you. There are too many of them. Comrades. Alright. Let's move. Where are you, man? Where did you go? Where is he? Did the mission bag out? Seriously? Do I have to kill you? Maybe he will appear magically. Come on, don't do this to me. Man, I spent like five minutes getting you here. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Jeez, you scared me so much. No, come on, let's talk. Let's talk. We should be safe here. They won't dare spill blood in front of a holy place. In the chaos, I managed to grab this from one of the guards. Perhaps it'll be of use to you. Oh, well, what did you, what did you get? Acquired map detailing position of Might, Might Adin's guard. What? I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that name, I'm so sorry. <clears throat> and my voice is getting lost again. But anyway, I found a map detailing the location of the guards standing today's execution. This will make, execution? Whoa. This will make things much easier. Well, it will. I think so. Well, by the looks of things, it won't be too easy. <laughs> like how many? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. Alright. Alright, I guess. Let's find something new. Should we do the pickpocket? Yeah, whatever. Let's do it. Let's not go through there because I will be attacked again. In there, there's like a mass grave forming in a process. But anyway, there should be the big pocket challenge. Probably some letter we have to steal. And from who? Oh, these two guys. Is it? Yeah, right. Let's get into this. Did you see the order? He wants us to repair a stage for another execution today. It's the one at the western edge of Solomon's temple. I was on my way just now. So much death. Worried that our true leader might return and bring a measure of justice to this city. Yes, and not this mockery Midget Dean parades before us. How? How does something like this happen? Everyone appointed in Salah Hadin's stead is met with an untimely end. And now the position falls to him. He, who was once nothing more than the Emir's scribe. How convenient. It would not surprise me to learn he was behind these accidents. Shh! If the guards hear us, we'll be taken for treason. 
executed on the very platform we have to repair. Come, let us return to work. <laughs> that would be ironic. Okay, let's grab this letter real fast before... Nope. Nothing to see here. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, let's move. Quickly. Because... Yeah. Oh, thank god. Acquired map showing the position of the seclusion plaza. Yeah, because if we had to get there, it would be much, much harder to get the letter. I would have to climb these walls, these buildings, I mean, and things like that. So anyway, let's check the map. Let's see. What did we find out? The target <laughs> is rumored to have reached his position through nefarious means. Alright, these rumors are likely true. Today's execution. Western edge of the Solomon's Temple. Okay, so this is the place of execution, right? Alright, that's useful. That's definitely useful to, to know. Alright. What else? The assassination challenge. Archer stealth the assassination challenge. That would be hard, I guess. Interrogation and eavesdrop. Now let's do the informant assassination challenge. Informer. Alright. Alright. Let's move through here. Oh, the camera is getting seizure. Right. I mean, I'm... I'm pretty sure... Alright. Nothing. Nothing. I thought there would be flag hidden in here. But all these locations are too similar. Someone is trying to attack me. For no reason. Not that it mattered. We are not collecting these flags at all. Because there is no reward for collecting them, as I already said in my previous episodes. You again, Grandmaster. Safety and peace. I'm so glad to see you. In these troubled times, they asked me to prove myself. But I feel so inadequate when I compare myself to you. I must kill two of Mujdudin's men without a fight. Could you show me the way? I will be forever grateful and share a very interesting story with you. All right. A story. I like stories. Oh no, where are you? There are these crazy people running about in here. Oh, this one is one of them. To kill. All right. That was easy. So far. And I'm not saying anything. I don't want to jinx it. Because, you know, I recommend you to watch my other series, which I'm doing on a... Brothers in Arms. And some of those things that happened to me in there. Actually, I'm playing Earning Blood to the second game in the Brothers in Arms series. And sometimes I jinx all of those things so... <laughs> so ironically, it's, it's amazing. Anyway, please check it out if you can. Thank you. You are the best the clan has ever seen. Here is my story, Master. I was cleaning the temple steps. I overheard two scholars praising how easy it was for them to pass the soldiers guarding the entrance of the execution plaza. If you time your entry properly, they could provide a nice distraction for the guards. But I am sure that with your wisdom, you knew that already. Of course I did. But thank you anyway. <laughs> Few scholars will try to enter the execution area. Well, we will use these scholars to our advantage. And by the way, I'm not that I'm not speaking to much people right now. As I already said, my mom is watching these videos, my sister, my niece. I don't really understand English, so I'm pretty much talking to myself. But you know, maybe one day, well, maybe. 100 people will watch this video in a year or two or something like that, but I don't really <laughs> I don't really know so but I'm quite You know, I'm realizing in what situation I am, you know that not many people are watching this, but anyway Let's let's hear what you gotta say. Oh, I'm too close. All right Is it better? 
so well, for none of us is above temptation. Should they act contrary to the law, no matter how minor it seems, they must be reported. A small crime today leads to larger ones tomorrow. Majduddin will help. Only come forward so that he might know their names. There is no harm in naming them. Those among you who defy the law. We are nothing without our faith, without its rules and its direction. To defy it is to defy the one who leads us. Such behavior cannot be allowed. Well, if you say so. But these are dangerous ideas. I will have to kill him. Where are you exactly? Oh, there you are. I totally lost you for a second. Anyway, you're still picking. You no. Know, picking up on, on in choosing distance from which I can talk to you or start the interrogation. Anyway. Yo! Don't you. Don't you. Don't you hit me. Don't you. Because I need to hit this one. Well, I don't know. I'm still on guard. He won't attack me, I think. But this one will. He's on his side. I know him. This traitor. Oh, he's not one of ours, so it doesn't matter. Where are you going, dude? What did you say? I don't want to kill him on this. I don't know. <laughs> public space. It looks too public, maybe. There. Where he's going, there will be some place. Let's kill him. Come on, buddy. Come on, this is taking too long. But yeah, I will attack you in here. Whatever. Come on. I will hit on you. Because it will take like forever to destroy all of you. Come on, a few more hits. Yeah, the hand-to-hand -hand combat isn't too good in this game, to be honest. It feels very clunky, and the attack is so, so slow. I mean, the animation, it takes so long to hit your target, and like, 60 or 70 percent of time he will just dodge the attack completely. Okay, one is killed. At least I got a knife. Well, it's beat. It's not killed. But I'm trying to hit you. Oh, come on, don't hit me again. Anyway. I still breathe. So you must desire more than just my life. What is it? You know Mejduddin well? Better than most. He seems a bit too righteous. Is the law really so important to him? What do you think? I think he hides something, and I think you'll tell me what it is. It's a veil. All of it. Men like me, we are meant to scare them, fill the people with fear. The ones he kills, not criminals, but dangerous all the same. Dangerous to who? His plans. Their plans. Yes, he speaks of others. Those he works with. Works for, perhaps. I am uncertain. They need the city, though. Controlling it is important to them. Why? You'll have to ask him yourself. Attend one of his executions. It's when he's most talkative, addressing the crowd, hands covered in blood. Then we are done. I will be there. Rest in peace. Right. Nothing happened. Alright. What do we have to do? I mean, this one is is harder, you know, than sitting on a bench and doing nothing. So we'll do the hard one first. This challenge of different different archers. How many throwing knives I have? Like nine. All right, we got to upgrade last episode from five to ten, which should help things. Well, you didn't so many people doing this then, I guess. I so many people. Oh, and I got stuck. Never mind. Well, let's find our informant. Not this way. We have to cross these. 
Oh, why do I climb this? I don't, I don't have to. I can just climb this one and get there faster, I guess. Yes. Oh, there you are. Hello there. Damned archers. We are to launch an assault against one of Medjduddin's lieutenants. But we cannot do anything until the rooftops have been cleared. And I have no men to spare. Would you be willing to help? Just make sure they do not see you coming. Or we will have to begin again. Of course. <laughs> How many? I don't see exactly. Well, at least... At least three. Maybe more. At least I know where they are hidden. This is one. Yes. He's yellow, which means he's the target. I just have to find the right way how to get on the roof without of him noticing me. Well, that was quick. I'm going to throw you out. Whatever. And why do I have to kill them stealthily? They won't tell anyone when they're dead. Alright, let's do this again. Without becoming exposed. But he turned around, which wasn't too good. Yeah, he won't see me from here. I will wait for him to turn around. No other archer in sight. Oh, this is not good. Go the other way. Go the other way, man. Oh no. Will he go? Oh yeah, he will. Come on, you turn around like... Like that. Get out of here. <laughs> How many of them are there? Oh no. Gosh, I'm so sorry about this. Go. Leave me alone. Right. This is one of those harder ones. I remember this. From many, many years ago. Oh, they're already <laughs> like two bodies. Nope. Okay, I'm getting frustrated. I'm so I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm getting frustrated. Leave me alone. Come on, this is stupid. Alright, I didn't finish any of them. Let's start with the other ones. And if it it's going to take that long, I will cut this out of the video probably. On this one. He's too far away. I'll wait for him and see what he does. And this one too. Okay, so three of them. Well I'll go go in here just to be safe. No. No, 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 no. He's seeing me, but maybe when he turns around. Maybe then. And when he will be walking that way, I will try to get him. There you go. Now it works. Alright, so he's down. <laughs> Those dead bodies lying everywhere. Okay, two more. I have to be really careful. I cannot hit him from here. I won't be able to, right? I don't think so. I need to go closer. Turn around. Walk away. Nothing to see here. Okay, you just broke your arm. Or dislocated your shoulder. I don't have a good feeling about this. Oh, come on. He's not walking too far away. Oh, 
Careful. Careful. I will try to get him with a knife. You know, when he turns around. Or with a hidden blade. Doesn't matter. And the last one. Oh man, this is getting intense. Anyone else? Hey, don't you judge me. I have one. Right now, let's climb this one. Slowly, but surely. Come on, Spider-Man. Alright, and... No, this is not good. This is not good. We have to wait for him to turn around. Go the other way. No, still not. The ideal position to be in. Alright, this would work. Oh, thank god. He's down. And now, slowly, I'm gonna jump in a bell of hay, just to be sure. I don't wanna walk too close to these guys, I'm afraid they will, they will attack me for no reason. Ah, but yeah, we made it. We made it. I'm starting to understand why Al-Mualim favors you. I assume you have been sent to deal with Merjudin, yes? Then it might help you to know that he enjoys lecturing his prisoners before executing them. While doing so, he turns his back to the crowd. It would be the perfect moment for you to strike. Now, I must attend to my men. We have our own targets to deal with. Okay, good luck. Much Dean turns his back to the crowd during his speeches. Well, I can use that to my advantage, I guess, and kill him. Maybe. I don't know how the situation will look. Hopefully. Let's hope. Maybe it will work like that. But anyway, let's find the... The dropping challenge. The easiest one. Which involves just sitting on a bench, doing nothing. But first, the real challenge is to find it. But it should be in here. Alright, so these two guys are going to talk. I think they're guys. <laughs> I didn't assume anything, I just I just think they're guys. Alright. Let's sit on this bench. This looks comfortable. Comfortable. Gosh darn it. Anyway, let's listen. I am sorry, Ahmad. They came without warning. My son? They have my son? What is to be done with him? We did everything we could. What is to be done with him? He's to be executed. Today. No. I won't allow it. But what can we do? Majduddin will hear no appeals. He says there can be no barter with God's will. This is not God's will, but madness. I'll go to him myself. Where is he? He will attend the execution. Perform it even. He enjoys the act. Truly evil man. We have no time to lose then. Let's go. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, we already know that he's performing an execution today, so it's you know not such big deal to to know this. So anyway, we got everything we need to know about our target. By the way, the last thing that I wanted to say, and it completely went out of my mind before, I will be talking about. Assassin's Creed Rebellion in my next video during those activities which I've mentioned but what I wanted to say is that in my previous video and I don't know in <laughs> what others I believe in the very first one sometimes there is some kind of graphical glitch going on which I don't really understand what's with that really I mean when when I was looking, observing Willem and Montferrat speaking to soldiers you know, the screen started to glitch out for a reason and I don't know why it's this going on because when I did record oh, there's the flag the gameplay, it wasn't doing such things I know I'm rendering my gameplay in a Sony Vegas but 
the strange thing is that I already you know, finished Brothers in Arms, Road to Hill 30, I'm playing Earning Blood, but it never happened in that game. It only happened in Assassin's Creed 1, on at least two instances. One when um, we performed the first Leap of Fate. I thought it may be an issue with, um, you know, first person view, with this one. But it wasn't really. I mean, I don't know what's with that. <laughs> so please excuse these graphical glitches. I don't know why they are in here included. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but I'm trying to fix it. But nothing works so far. Anyway, let's talk to Malik. What news, novice? I am not a novice. A man's skill is defined by his actions, not the markings on his robe. We can trade barbs or do El Muallim's work. It's your decision. Then be out with it. Jerusalem's regent Mejduddin is holding a public execution not far from here. It's sure to be well guarded, but it's nothing I can't handle. I know what to do. And that is why you remain a novice in my eyes. You cannot know anything. Only suspect. You must expect to be wrong. To have overlooked something. Anticipate, Altair. How many times must I remind you of this? As you wish. Are we done? Not quite. There is one more thing. One of the men to be executed is a brother. One of us. Al Mulim wishes for him to be saved. Do not worry about the actual rescue. My men will take care of that. But you must ensure Majduddin does not take his life. I won't give him the chance. So I hope. I will try, at least. Can I go now? Malik? Alright. God, you such a... Uh, grammar. I don't know, I don't want to say that word. Nationalist. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to get into trouble. But anyway, yeah, strike. The target during the execution. He'll be, I don't know where. <laughs> what was that all about? That was pretty close. Not too far from here. So it should be fine. Well, let's climb down. Climb out. Or on. The sidewalk. Gosh, my English. Sometimes I feel like, yeah, it's it's okay. It's acceptable. And sometimes it's, oh man, what am I even talking about? <laughs> it depends. Guys, I need to get there. Can you get me? Almost out co Come on, scores will help me. Or you will go this way. Well, it's a longer way, but you no, know, it's up to you, I guess. Hello there, nothing to see. Nothing to see here, alright. I hope we're on the right place. Gosh, if you lead me into some other way. You know what you did, probably. There's a graveyard. Can I go through here? Nope. I have to go back. Well, it didn't help me at all. Oh, guys. I need to go out of here. Guys, let me out of here. What did you do? This is not the right place. I don't want to kill anyone because I don't want to blow my cover before the executions. Yeah, I'll just get through these guys. Again. Alright, seems clear. Let's get on a roof. Because I need to get through these guys. Right in there. Alright. Right. Good. Good, Anakin. Oh no, so many archers. Well, let's get... Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying, I'm trying. Don't hit me. Don't hit me, please. Alright, that worked. Well, let's attend the execution. I will be quiet during this part, I promise. Jerusalem! 
Come, hear me well. I stand here today to deliver a warning. There are malcontents among you. They sow the seeds of discontent, hoping to lead you astray. Tell me, is this what you desire? To be mired in deceit and sin? To live your lives in fear? Then you wish to take action? We do. Your devotion pleases me. This evil must be purged. Only then can we hope to be redeemed. This is not justice. And all of you stand idle, complicit in this crime. See how the evil of one man spreads to corrupt others? They sought to instill fear and doubt within you. But I will keep you safe. Here now are four filled with sin. The harlot, the thief, the gambler, the heretic. Let God's judgment be brought down upon them. Man, you're crazy. Gosh, what the hell was that? You blow my cover. I didn't do anything. Man, that was such an <laughs> unexpected turn of the events. It wasn't my fault. Come on, guys. I was pushed. I didn't do anything. Okay, I will keep this in here, I guess. <laughs> this is good to leave it out. I guess. Well, I will kill all of you now. I'm sorry. The Malik will be upset, I guess. <laughs> but it wasn't my fault at all what happened. I don't take responsibility. But you know what? I saved everyone. I will have to kill everyone else, but I saved these four. Get out of here. What did she say? There you go. First damage. Oh no. And the other. I took. Are you respawning? I hope not. Because this will take a long time to beat. Hopefully not. And someone is walking around my house doing something. <laughs> I'm sorry if you hear something on the back background, I mean. But here yeah, there there's a few of them. Just a few of them <laughs> left. There will be no witnesses. Well, this is stealth mission. No one will know about this crime because everyone will be dead. Who attended? <laughs> His execution, this is like mass murder. No, you will not. I will kill your tar your guards. I mean targets. Why do I say targets? Anyway. Aha, uh -huh, you run away. There you go. Bye. Your work here is finished. No. No! It had only just begun. Tell me, what's your part in all of this? Do you intend to defend yourself as the others have and explain away your evil deeds? The Brotherhood wanted the city. I wanted power. There was an opportunity. An opportunity to murder innocents? Not so innocent. Dissident voices cut deep as steel. They disrupt order. In this, I do agree with the Brotherhood. You'd kill people simply for believing differently than you. Of course not. I killed them because I could, because it was fun. Do you know what it feels like to determine another man's fate? And did you see the way that people cheered? The way they feared me? I was like a god. You'd have done the same if you could. 
such power once perhaps but then i learned what becomes of those who lift themselves above others and what is that here let me show you you understand now buddy you should rest in peace okay let's get out of here no one is Attacking us because everyone is dead. You know, that's one way to complete the mission, I guess. And it wasn't my fault, I mean, but it's too good to leave out <laughs> and do this another time. I mean, it, it never happened to me like this. I blew up, blew up my cover in this mission many times in the past, but you know, not like this. Gosh, and it's still good to leave out. I love this. <laughs> Fortunately, the bureau is not too far. Should be fine. And no one is on a roof because no one is attacking me. You know, if I killed him stealthily, all those 20 plus soldiers would be on my neck right now. <laughs> I mean, well, there's something good in everything, I guess. Blessing in disguise. Well, we're back. <laughs> we are back, Malik. It went exactly as I planned. Okay. Jerusalem needs a new ruler. So I have heard. What's this? No words of wisdom for me? Surely I have failed in some spectacular fashion. You performed as an assassin should. No more, no less. That you expect praise for merely doing as told, however, troubles me. It seems everything I do troubles you. Reflect on that. But do so on your way back to Masyaf. Your work here is done. Well, thank you. Why you are so rude? Always. Come on. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Well, let's get back. And we'll be cut out from the animus, I guess. Because this was the last part of the memory block for. So, anyway. We're not going to back to Amualim, but to present times. We done already? Get up. Whatever you say, Doc. I'm ending the session. No, I'll be right there. You're sure about this? Yes. No. Everything's Denver. I don't see how he could... Of course. I understand. You're in a lot of trouble, Mr. Miles. What's his problem? They're coming for you. Who's coming for me? Assassins. Hey, I had nothing to do with this. Sounds like they're mounting some kind of rescue attempt. Guess you're more important than you realized. Man, things just keep getting weirder and weirder around here. It was bound to happen. What do you mean? That little fight your ancestors started during the Third Crusade, it never ended. You're being held by Templars. Vidix a Templar? There's no way you could have known. They hide it so well. But to answer your question, Vidic works for them. We all do. Abstergo is their company. I thought Templars were old dudes with funny hats who sat around drinking beer and plotting world domination with, like, the lizard people. No. Except the part about world domination, I guess. Look. Desmond, it's complicated. Half the stuff they say about the Templars comes from crazy tinfoil hat-wearing nut jobs. The other half is misinformation intentionally produced by the Templars themselves. But they are the bad guys, right? If there's one thing I've learned since I started working here, it's that there's no such thing. It's all so relative. I guess the best way to explain it is what they want is good. But the way they're going about it, it's bad really bad. What are they trying to do? Lucy? Yes? Miss Stillman, I need to speak with you. Get up here, now! On my way, Doctor. I'm sorry, Desmond, I have to go. You should turn in for the night. Come on, seriously? The answers to all of your questions are right in front of you. You just have to know where to look. Um, what does that mean? <laughs> Curious. Seriously, you're just gonna walk away? What? 
Well, then leave, I guess. Hmm. Well, you can't leave before I get into my bedroom, I guess. Alright. Well, that's one way to put it. But I have a code for unlocking these doors. You see? <laughs> Stealthy. With cameras on every corner. What are these machines anyway? Some processors, I guess. Something like that. There's a chair, another one. You know, we took the pen from Widdick, so let's check his computer. Maybe some nasty things will appear. Ah, uh, you may never know. Anti-password. Oh, thank you. Like, Mr. Robot. <laughs> this feels like... Anyway, let's see what is in the inbox. By the way, if you want to read these individual files, you can stop the video at the appropriate time, you know, and just read it in full. I won't, I won't go through this real quickly. Alright, so find, let's find the original message. Oh, there you are. Mr. Ray King, I hope you might be able to help me understand why it no one is willing to tell me what happened to my friend. Lucy is asking. I think my record at the company speaks for itself. Thank you for the assistance. Well, what was the answer? From Rickin. I'll be out of the office during September. Well, typical. I mean, <laughs> you didn't help at all. Well, thank you. Concat. Uh, Contact someone else. Concat, what does that even mean? You told me she wasn't going to be a problem, and here she's stirring up the soup. Shoop. Okay, deal with this, Warren. You watch for her. Alright, you're responsible for her. Not only headlines, let's see what's what's new. Tension mouse over Antarctic drilling on uh, platforms. Oh, two navels, destroyers. Well, alright. Oh, I guess. What about in here? Yes, this is too long. Hurricane season ends and a hapstern go satellite launch postponed until December 21st, 2012. Well, what was about to happen on December 21st, 2012? Well, you know, if you're old enough. <laughs> anyway, yeah, there's... Is there something else? Yeah, there is. Alright. I will move through here. And out of here. If you if you want to, you can read it. Without any issues. I will wait for you. When you, when you pause the video. Trust me, I will. Let's go to our box. Oh, Layla. We already talked... Talked about this and read about this. Yeah, nothing new. I'll we'll just get through this, ban, yeah. Deleted items. Interesting. Sandra, known. I know. What do you know? I know what you're doing. I know what you did. I saw him. He had a metal ball. It opened. That went crazy, shooting, stabbing, tore each other to pieces. I know it was you people, so the lock heard the name. I'm going to tell anyone who will listen. You will be exposed. They know the truth, and you will pay, you crazy bastards. You'll pay. All right. Ooh, Jesus. And what about this one? Oh, it's the typical, you know, ordinary corporation thingy. All right. Now let's see Ellis's computer as well. If something else appeared in there. And a password, and... Let's quickly just go through this. Layla, yeah. Marino, we already read about this. Yeah, nothing new. Alright, we can go to bed. And finish this day off. Oh, there are some interesting... <laughs> Air conditioners. Nothing else to, to see in here? I guess not. Okay, let's go to bed. You don't have to pee, right? 
Okay, you didn't say anything. So I guess not. Let's sleep. Well, where's Widdick? There's nowhere to be seen. Oh, well, there you are. Good morning. Missed you this morning, Doc. Get in the animus. What happened? Hello, Lucy. Can I talk to you anyway? Maybe about something on your computer? Nope. Okay, drink your coffee, then... I don't need you anyway. Okay, let's get back before he gets angry. I know him already. Alright. So, how many more do we have? How many more memory blocks? Gosh, shut the hell up. Man, memory block 5, 6, and you now this strange low-key memory. Alright, let's get into this. Loads latest memory selecting the hidden blade during fight will allow you to I, mean, I trust you're well rested ready for your remaining trials I am but I'd speak with you first I have questions ask them I'll do my best to answer the merchant king of Damas murdered the nobles who ruled his city Mejdeddin in Jerusalem used fear to force his people into submission I suspect William meant to murder Richard and hold Akka with his troops. These men were meant to aid their leaders. Instead, they chose to betray them. What I do not understand is why. Is the answer not obvious? The Templars desire control. Each man, as you've noted, wanted to claim their cities in the Templar name, that the Templars themselves might rule the Holy Land and eventually beyond. But they cannot succeed in their mission. Why is that? Their plans depend upon the Templar treasure, the Peace of Eden. But we hold it now, and they cannot hope to achieve their goals without it. What is this treasure? It is temptation. It's just a piece of silver. Look at it. What am I supposed to see? This piece of silver cast out Adam and Eve. It turns staves into snakes parted and closed the Red Sea. Eris used it to start the Trojan War, and with it a poor carpenter turned water into wine. It seems rather plain for all the power you claim it has. How does it work? He who holds it commands the hearts and minds of whoever looks upon it. Whoever tastes of it, as they say. Then Gagne's men? An experiment. Herbs used to simulate its effects, to be ready for when they held it. Talel supplied them. Tamir equipped them. They were preparing for something. But what? War. And the others, the men who ruled the cities, they meant to gather up their people, make them like Gagne's men. The perfect citizens, the perfect soldiers, a perfect world. Robert de Sable must never have this back. So long as he and his brothers live, they will try. That they must be destroyed. Which is what I've had you doing. There are two more Templars who require your attention. One in Akka, known as Sibran. One in Damas, called Jubair. Visit with the Bureau leaders. They'll instruct you further. As you wish. Be quick about it. No doubt Robert de Sable is made nervous by our continued success. His remaining followers will do their best to expose you. They know you come. The man in the white hood. They'll be looking for you. They won't find me. I'm but a blade in the crowd. Here, my gift to you. In gratitude for the good work you've done. Oh, thank you, Master. I guess. Well, blade in a crowd. You could have seen it last time. <laughs> it wasn't that stealthy in any way. Oh, man. Defense break, you can practice in a courtyard. Finally, we'll will something. Defense break, sounds interesting. But anyway, I gotta pause it, I'm already recording too much. 
Yeah, we will travel to Acre and Damascus in the other episodes. Anyway, so I gotta pause it. Thank you very much and very kindly for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. I hope you had fun. And if I made your day better, I would be, you know, very glad and very happy for it. Thank you, my friends. Stay healthy, stay safe, and I hope to see you next time. So, yeah. God bless. Bye-bye. And Raven out.